The Smart Clothing Smart Girls program is a National Science Foundation funded program that looks to engage girls 11 to 14 in science, technology, engineering, and math through something that they're already curious about, which is fashion design. Hi, I'm Kristen Morris, and I'm a doctoral candidate at the Department of Fiber Science and Apparel Design at Cornell University. My name is Hannah Kang, and I'm going to be a freshman at Christian Brothers Academy. When I grow up, I want to be in the science field, and I want to work with my hands a lot. When we got here, we started to get to know each other and started introducing the idea of designing. Hi, my name is Mia Adams. I'm going to be a freshman at Henniger High School. I thought the body scanning was really cool because it took like a hundred pictures from the top down of you at all different points. I'm Professor Susan Ashdown. I'm the Helen G. Kanoyer Professor in Apparel Technology in the Department of Fiber Science and Apparel Design at Cornell University. My research is in 3D body scanning. 3D body scanner is just an elaborate camera, basically, or set of cameras. What it captures it is it captures the 3D shape, so the actual shape of the body. So we're using it um, this week um, to introduce young girls. Um, we, we want them to be as excited about technology as we are and as excited about what we, can, what we do do in the apparel industry. We consider ourselves engineers, engineers of clothing, and it takes a lot of knowledge about materials and about um, the way things go together, about proportion, about um, shapes of patterns, things like that. We want the girls to understand that and to give them the opportunity to have a three-dimensional image of themselves and have it on the computer as a virtual model and then to be able to dress that model themselves. Hi, my name is Daniel Tell, and I'm a project manager at Clove Virtual Fashion. So Clove Virtual Fashion was founded in January of 2009. We have over 10 years of research and development in garment simulation. Our business is in making 3D garments drape and move as they would in real life. So we offer two different solutions. We have Marvelous Designer, which is used by the gaming and animation industries. And then we have Clo3D, which is geared towards the fashion and apparel industries. The Clo3D is really revolutionary because it's really gonna give designers an opportunity to really be creative. You know, being creative is such a luxury these days in the design field because designers are always chasing samples, they're going back and forth with their factories, so it can take up to three months for them to really decide on a final product. By using Clo3D, you can test out all these design changes and different ideas in real time, so it gives them the opportunity to really do what designing is all about. The reason why we're here at Cornell um, at the SCSG event is to really give the girls an opportunity to really see how technology is part of fashion. Designers in the real world are using Quilt3D today, and we wanted the girls to be able to experience the technology firsthand, but without having to learn the more sophisticated tools designers use in Quilt3D. Marvelous Designer is kind of like Clo3D's little rebel sister, and it's perfect for these girls because it doesn't really require much pattern making experience. With the things that they've learned about fabrics and sewing and about body scanning, they're able to you know, incorporate all of these things together and really put them into a garment that fits them. The advantage of us using Marvelous Designer with the girls is that you can really see in real time what the 2D pattern shapes will look like on the three-dimensional body. 
uh, just as in the industry, it gives them tools that allow them to do so much more than if we were always working with fabric and scissors and making uh, actual physical prototypes. Being able to work with it on the computer allows them to experiment more, to do more things, um, and of course to do it on, their, on themselves, which they couldn't do if they were making clothes um, as easily. They can get a better sense of how things drape, and how they can really use technology to have a more sustainable and more creative way to approach their designs. And as a way to just, you know, thank the girls and, you know, have them enjoy the fact that they use Marvelous Designer, we're going to take the sketches and the prototypes that they've made um, throughout this whole week and everything that's been leading up to this point, um, we're going to take those garments and we're going to create a virtual fashion show for them.